Hello, in this session, we are going to talk about your Terraform registry. Now, Terraform registry is simply a central repository that is managed by Terraform and it's an interactive resource where we can find all the providers, the modules, the policies that we can use with Terraform. So, uh, you can think of it as a documentation that is available uh, for using with Terraform. So if you want to see what all providers that are available or what are modules that are that we can use or what all various policies that are available for us to use, we can get all that information from the Terraform registry. So this registry includes solutions developed by HashiCorp, the company that introduced this Terraform tool, then uh, solutions developed by third party vendors and also the community that is working on Terraform. Now, the whole point of this registry is to provide the necessary plugins that you can use to manage your infrastructure. Like for example, let's say the AWS plugin or the Azure plugin. So all these informations will be available in the registry. It also provides you with pre-made modules, meaning uh, the code that you can use to quickly conf configure common infrastructure components and also examples of how you can write the Terraform code. So let's say you know you want to get started with creating a uh, VPC or you want to get started with launching an EC2 instance. Now this registry will also contain example codes that we can use and we, we can quickly get started to create those resources. Now. This is the URL which you can use to access the registry. So here, registry.terraform.io, this is the registry that Terraform is managing. So here you can see you have the providers, you have the modules, you have policies, you also have uh, run tasks. So let's say I want to see what all providers that are available. So I can go to browse providers and here I should be able to see all the providers that are available. Likewise, I want to see the modules that are available again, depending on the provider. So this is for AWS VPC, again, AWS IAM, AWS Security Group, AWS EKS. Likewise, you will have a pre-built code that we can use to quickly get started uh, to create the resources. So here you can see this is for creating a VPC. So like this, Terraform registry will contain all the documentation that we can use to get started with Terraform. So the Terraform registry, it is integrated directly into Terraform. So we as a user can directly specify the providers and the modules that we want to use and Terraform will download all that information from the Terraform registry for us. Now anyone can publish and consume these providers, modules and policies on the public Terraform registry. So whatever we are seeing here, this is a public Terraform registry and anyone can push. So let's say you can also create modules and you can push it to the Terraform registry and anyone can consume this uh, uh, modules, the providers from the Terraform registry since it is public. Now you can also create your own uh, private registries if you want to work within your organization or reference repositories and other sources directly. So generally at an organization level, we will always create a private registry and then we will start uh, giving access to other people so that they can start using that private registry to gather all the information like uh, modules, for example. Now for Terraform users, the Terraform registry enables the distribution. So like I said, it's the whole, the whole point of this is to share it could be sharing the modules, it could be sharing the uh, provider. So basically making your configurations reusable. So you're sharing it with other people who are working on Terraform. So this Terraform registry, it simply acts as a centralized repository. All right. So me as a user, as a Terraform user, I can create a module, I can push it to Terraform registry. You can, you can start create, using those modules to create the resources in your infrastructure okay so that's the whole point of this terraform registry which acts as a centralized repository for sharing making the modules easier to discover and also to reuse the module so that's basically what your terraform registry is that's all for this session thank you once again before you leave please don't forget to subscribe to the channel 
and if you like the video leave a like and please share the video